Hi everyone, Dolly here with Crafty Mermaid Mom. I hope you guys are enjoying your day. Despite this horrible weather, we've been getting a lot of rain here in Southern California, but I think we need it, so I'm not complaining at all. So a few days ago, I did take a trip to Tuesday morning because I was looking for uh, double-sided paper and I didn't really have a lot of luck in finding double-sided paper. I did find one pad, but I found a lot of other great deals because I found some new items there at Tuesday morning. So I am uh, going to be sharing with you all the things that I purchased from my visit. So this right here, says I love you it's I heart you and they're only 99 cents so this one right here with the heart I don't know why but the price was peeled off on this but um let me go ahead and give you the SKU number for this one this may have been a return um and let me give you the number on this one the item number on this one and what i love about these are that they're so small they will fit in friend mail really nicely with they won't really bulk up the package so this punch right here is just a heart punch but i love the size of this so those are my uh, very first two items and the great part is they were only 99 cents each so on this trip i also bought a bunch of tools which i had never seen there before and um, before I show you those tools, I wanted to show you some other tools that I have been looking for that I did find. The first one being this uh, We Are Memory Keepers Crafters Essentials Bone Folder. You guys, I have the little thin bone folders that I use that come with my scoring pad and that also comes with one of my paper trimmers. But, you know, I lose them so often and I figure having this will be convenient because I know I can't lose this, it's too large to lose, and it covers a lot of space. So I thought I'd try this, and it's only $4.99. Again, it's by We Are Memory Keepers. And here is the SKU number on this one. And so um, I've seen these before, and I've always wanted one, so I decided I'm gonna get it because I know I'll get a lot of use out of it. So the very next item that I purchased was this food pick, is what it's called, but Mm, I don't think it's a food pick. I would definitely use this to make holes in my paper or to punch holes in my paper. And it's a nice size because look at how long this pick is. It'll go um, through pretty thick paper, I think. And let me show you the SKU number on this. It was only $2.49. And I had never seen these uh, at Tuesday morning. So I've seen these before, but I just wasn't as interested. This is by Sweet Sugar Bell. So I thought uh, this would be nice. And I think this is for baking. So I thought I'd try it with my crafting. And uh, so that was a really great find, I feel. And then let me go ahead and show you guys the uh, other tools that I bought. So when I went in there, I wasn't expecting to see these. But um, like I said, I was looking for double-sided paper. And instead, I noticed they had a new supply of X tools and I don't know if you call them ek tools or if they're called ek tools but I bought and found some punches that were such a great deal so the first punch that I found is one that I have been wanting to buy for a long time I was very close to buying this online and it was just a little too pricey for me but when I saw them there I couldn't believe it you guys these are great quality punches if you've ever used or if you own any EK tools you will know that they are sturdy and they're durable and they are uh, really good quality. So I grabbed this right away. And what I love about this is that it's a layering punch. The first time I ever saw this was on YouTube because somebody, uh, one of the crafters was creating a little shaker uh, paper clip and they used this punch and I wanted one so badly. I went online and it was so costly that I thought, oh, I'll just wait. Maybe I'll find something that I could use to create those little shaker um, paper clips. So when I saw this at Tuesday morning, I grabbed it really quick because um, for $5.99, you cannot beat that. I know that these normally sell around 20 or 20 something dollars. And 
the the reason why these are probably so pricey is because you get five different punches out of this one tool it actually has a setting here that adjusts to the uh, punch that you actually will be getting out of it and let me show you you can see the designs right here so one allows you to punch this and then this and then this and here are the different designs that you get and this is what allows you to do the little mini shaker tags or the shaker um paper clips i could not walk away and um not get this because like i said it's it's something that i have been eyeing for a while and looking at so i noticed they also had this design the same design in an oval shape and i thought about getting that but i had to um tell myself no because I already have this or I already purchased this. I don't need an oval one, but I did, however, find one in the heart shape. And this one, I know I'll be getting a lot of use out of. Again, it comes with five different shapes of hearts. And um, this one has also three settings for whichever one you want to punch, whether it be a solid heart or two pieces, one with a border and one with a solid. And then here's one that has the different size hearts in solids and borders. So I had to grab this. Here is the SKU number for this one. $5.99 also. And again by ek tools and you guys if you could feel these these are solid and very heavy and i do own a few ek punches and i love them because i feel like they're probably one of the better quality uh crafting tools okay so i also purchased this item right here and this is a scalloped circle and the reason why i got this it's three quarters of an inch is because there is a scallop circle on here as well that's a little larger than this and i thought this would be great in layering with this piece right here and this one was also 4.99 i know it's smaller and um it's still a good price for me because i know i'll get a lot of use out of this one I have a scallop circle, but not one as small as this. And let me go ahead and show you the SKU number on this one. Okay. All right. So the next item that I got and the very last uh, item by EK Tools that I purchased was this um, cut and perforate tool and I thought it was interesting and so for $2.19 I felt like this was a bargain. Let me go ahead and show you the SKU number on this one. There you go, and this is what it looks like, okay? All right, so the next item um, that I purchased, or the next few items I purchased were just crafting goods, and um, I purchased uh, this decorative ribbon. I love this color. I do have a color or a ribbon similar to this, but it's in a thinner um, size than this and I like the fact that this is a little wider so I can use this for various projects. I also, oops, let me show you the SKU number on this one. There you go, this was only 99 cents. Okay, and then I also purchased this one right here. Did I give you guys the SKU on this? I did. I also purchased these uh, medium glitter brads in this beautiful blue. These are by American Crafts Elements. And these were only $1.49, but I had to grab them because they are in my favorite blue and they are in a glitter. So here is the SKU number, $1.49, and you get quite a few in here. Um, yeah, let me see if it actually shows how many total brads you get. Yeah, I don't see that there's a quantity on here, but clearly there's quite a few. So how to get that. And then I also grabbed this right here. It's a die template of arrows. And I don't know why, but I, I had the need for an arrow sticker a while back. 
And in my mind, I was thinking how great it would be if I had an arrow punch. Oh, it was because I was making one of those waterfall cards and I wanted to stick a sticker at the very bottom so that they would know or whoever it was that I was gifting the card to would know to pull. That's the reason why I was looking for or wanted to have a arrow sticker or something like this and when I saw this that's what I thought about immediately and I thought for $3.19 I had to grab this so here is the SKU number for this and I love the fact that they're in pink okay so I did buy another die and this die actually comes with clear stamps and this one right here is of a mason jar and I think what got me on this because I have to be honest I do have a mason jar already but I don't have the cute stamps that coordinate with it and I love the fact that this right here has a little ribbon that you could um, stamp right on top and then it also has the label and it has thanks for everything love and a little tag that says for you and then hearts and flowers. So you can actually put the flowers inside, you could put the hearts inside, the butterfly, you know, on the outside. It's up to you where you wanna put that, but I could not resist. And for $4.99 to get both the die and then also the stamps was such a great deal. Okay, so the next uh, item that I purchased were, um, some Project Life cards, and this is actually in the Mother's Day theme. A lot of these cards don't reference Mother's Day. A few of them do, but I love the colors of these cards, and let me go ahead and show you some of the designs. I'm not gonna pull them out just because it will uh, take too much time, but you can see here the colors are in the mints, pinks, and really nice pastel colors, which I love, and so I had to grab that and here is the SKU number okay and the next item that I got were these very cute die cuts and this is by I don't know if it's uh, pink paisley I don't know if wild child is the maker or oh I think it is pink paisley is the maker and wild child is the name of this theme for these die cuts but look at how cute these die cuts are they're ephemera pieces and here on the back you could see all of the pieces that it comes with and aren't these so cute I especially love the little guitar right in the front and um, all of the colors are just so cute the colors are just so pretty and I work with these colors with um, with a lot of my paper pads so I think I'll get a lot of use out of these really cute Okay, and then um, this right here, I love buying these Anna Griffin cards because they're so beautiful. And you guys, these are only $2.49 and you get how many? You get four cards that you could construct and they're so pretty. And here is the SKU number, 249. Okay, and then the next item that I purchased was this very cute stencil. And I am working on a tea themed project right now. So I thought this would be so cute to use. It's got the cake, it's got the chairs and the little table. And it's just so cute. I love the wine and the wine glass. And I hate to say this, but I think I may have purchased this before and I just can't find where it is. Anyway, it was only $1.99, you guys. And if I find that I did purchase it before, I will use this in a rack package. So, it, you know, this one is not going to go to waste if I have it. Um, again, I can use that in a rack. Okay, so um, I also purchased another stamp and die set, which I absolutely fell in love with. And... I was just so amazed to find it because I love cherry blossoms, you guys, and I found a cherry blossom tree with a stencil and stamps, and look at how beautiful this is. Here is the tree and the branches, and then here are all of the beautiful cherry blossoms, and here is the stencil, and look at what it can make. Isn't that so pretty? I can't wait to try and make this. I'm so excited. This is uh, Stamps by Chloe and Crafter's Companion Clear Stamp Metal Die Set. 
And again, it's by Stamps by Chloe. Here is the SKU number on this one. For $4.99, I thought this was a great deal and I'm really excited about using this. And then I have only two more items left that I purchased. I did find one pad of the double-sided paper that I originally went into that store to buy. And it was one that I had bought in the past, but I had already used up. So I was glad to find another one. It is this two-sided or double-sided pad called Wildflower. It's by DCWV. And the paper in here is so beautiful. Let me go ahead and do a quick flip through for you guys so that you can see the designs. I haven't opened it yet, but you can pretty much see the paper that's in here. So there are a lot of floral spring-like themes in this uh, paper pad. And I love the two-sided pads because I like doing projects that uh, have a lot of folds where you can see both sides so that's the reason why I was uh, looking for a double-sided paper so this one was only $6.99 here is the SKU number and again this one is called Wildflower and so finally the last item that I purchased was a paper pad you guys I bought this semi-solid paper pad by Momenta and um, you get 48 pieces, but the colors in this are so beautiful. And yes, a lot of them are solids, but also a lot of them have some type of a very simple, clean design like this one right here is just such a beautiful color. And I love the fact that they are double-sided. And I think, or I feel like I can really go to town with decorating these because the pages are plain and I can do so much with them. And look at how brilliant these colors are. I just think they're gorgeous. I just fell in love with this pad, so had to get this. And those are the colors you get. You get quite a few, and let me show you the price and the SKU number on this. This was only $5.99 for 48 pieces. So here is the SKU number. And that was it for my purchase, you guys. Um, I'm really excited about this purchase because I haven't, um, I've been trying to stay away from Tuesday morning because I don't need any more items, but I am so glad I went in there. Um, specifically because those punches are something I have been looking at for a while now, and I just really didn't want to put that much money into. Um, I know I would use them, but I felt like it wasn't worth me paying full price for them. So that is my haul for today and I hope that you guys enjoyed watching this. Thank you so much for stopping by and have a great day. Bye-bye.